Hey everyone, and welcome to No Code MBA. In this video, I'm going to cover a new feature on Lovable that I think could be a game changer with AI app builders. You're going to see how Lovable is combining AI generation with almost no code tool functionality of allowing you to click on what you want to change and then uh, make changes yourself. So kind of combining the human and the AI. So you don't have to fully rely on prompting to get the design exactly how you want it to be. Before we get started, if you want to follow along and build this yourself, click the link in the description to go to Lovable and start building with me. This video is also brought to you by No Code MBA. Uh, if you want to learn more about building with No Code and AI tools and learn from experts in the industry, check the link in the description to learn more about No Code MBA. Let's go ahead and get started. So, what we're going to do to test out and demonstrate this uh, new feature is we're going to have Lovable build a landing page for us. So the prompt is going to be create a simple landing page to collect lead information for a webinar about how to build with AI apps like Lovable. I want to collect name and email. So let's go ahead and uh, generate. So on the right side, Lovable is going to spin up a preview. So we're going to um, let it do its thing here. And I'm just going to go ahead and pause the video um, as it builds. So on the left side, you can see it's kind of coming up with design, inspiration, features, etc. But I'm going to go ahead and pause the video and let it build. And I'll unpause it once uh, we have something to look at. So here we have the landing page that it generated. Really simple. And I did ask for a simple landing page, I guess. But I actually like how it turned out. Just build AI apps with Lovable. Learn how to create powerful AI apps uh, without complex coding. Join our expert-led webinar and transform your development process. So name and email, just like I asked it to, along with this register for webinar button. So uh, what I want to show you now is this new edit feature. So this is the big feature that we have uh, that is kind of a game changer here. So if I click edit, now we can see as we hover over any of these elements, uh, it is going to allow us to make some changes. So let's say I hover over this div, which um, basically is what these buttons are inside. So let's click on it. When you click on it right here, it's giving us options to change the padding, change the background, change the border radius, or under advanced, we can just change the code directly. So let's say we want to change the background. And it's what's nice is it's giving us kind of these uh, pre uh, pre kind of buttons just to click, which already are going to look nice with our design. Or we can go to custom and just make it any color we want. Uh, so let's stick with the styles it gives us. And let's say we want to change it to like a kind of a gray color there. So by doing that here, you can see the code changes. Uh, you also can then just go ahead and click Save. So there we go, it just made an edit and we're still in edit mode. So let's say we wanna change the background a little bit. So let's click on background, let's go to custom and let's say we wanna make this like a purple, like a really light purple or pink even. So we can go ahead and do that. We just do that, go ahead, go ahead and click save. And there we go. Now it just made that change directly. We didn't have to ask Lovable that. Um, which is huge. It just saves a bunch of time to not have to go in and ask Lovable to make every change. And it also lets you just kind of tweak it as a human and play around with the colors and design to what you want. Um, let's go back to this div real quick and let me show you what it looks like if you change the padding. So we can do that, change the padding left and right. We can change the up and down padding as well, top and bottom, and go ahead and click save. Um, also, if we click edit, on this text, we can just start typing and change the copy directly, which I think is also amazing. We don't have to ask Lovable to do that. We just go ahead and just click and start changing the text anywhere we want. So free webinar, don't miss out, for example. And then we just go ahead and click save. Um, awesome. And you can see different elements have different things to edit also. So here, if we click on this div, border radius, this is an, it kind of gives us different options here. We can change it to none. And you can see now it's a little, um, 
it has squared off corners instead of the curve. Um, so just kind of an example to show you uh, what's possible. Um, I definitely recommend uh, clicking the link in the description, going to Lovable and trying this out for yourself. I think this is an amazing new feature. I'm personally going to use it um, in my own Lovable builds. And I think it's going to save me a lot of time and help me customize things uh, just a lot easier to exactly what I want them to be. So thanks for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, be sure to check out the link in the description, both to go to Lovable, also to go to No Code MBA. Uh, if you want to learn more about building with No Code and AI tools um, like from in a lot more detail from start to finish with in-depth hour-long courses from industry experts. Uh, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel to get more updates on AI apps and other no-code tools like this. And leave a comment if you have any questions at all. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you in the next video.